Hey there, this is Dave Garner with MagneticSponsors.com and today I want to talk to you a little bit about Pingler. And first we're going to go over to a blog post that I recently did about cooperation. This is my uh, normal everyday blog, the davidgardner.com. And I basically blog about all different uh, stuff, but I have a major focus on marketing and online marketing and you know things like that. So uh, the blog post, how well do you cooperate with others? Now what you want to do, you want to be able to get your blog to go out to the world and not just you know having you go and post it on social media places which is good and you have places where people can share for example like Twitter Google Plus you know if you scroll down here I'll have some other options as well you know basically you got sociable and you know things like that so you want to be able to get stuff out but you also want it to go a little bit more generically as well to all the search engines so what I want to do I'm going to uh, highlight just by left clicking on my title in the browser and then right clicking and then actually copying that link and then I want you to do you want you go over to a site called Pingler if you, you don't have to worry about the S just type in Pingler.com don't you don't again you don't have to worry about typing in that stuff Pingler.com and it will actually automate what Pingler does is will actually ping all the search engines so you can do this a couple times a day for different blogs. You wouldn't do it for the same exact blog post, but you can accept uh, a few times. I believe it's every three days you can blog an actual post, but you can do multiple times on different webs on your website if you have different posts along there. Let's say you did two or three posts today. You can ping as many as you want on different websites, but I believe it might be limited to three. So again, uh, automatic. There are paid uh, options, two ninety nine a month for the lowest amount. I go with the free one. Uh, again, it's just something I just spent a couple seconds on doing. So basically, there's two things you're going to add here, the title of your article and the URL. So I'm just going to do, you can either right click and, well, in this case, it kind of disappeared, but I'm going to control V. Again, I could have used control C on the other page, control, control C copies, control V paste. And then I'm just going to go back to the page and I'm going to highlight over my title here. I'm going to copy. So again, control C copies it and then click in here and control V, uh, excuse me, control V will paste it. Then you have a, a whole bunch of categories that you can choose from. You now because this is geared towards like business and marketing and blogging, uh, I'm going to pick, uh, I picked the business, I'm going to do education and I am going to do uh, marketing here. So again, you're going to have that and then basically these are all the blogs that are being pinged. So it's a lot of Google searches from all in Google uh, search engines and spiders and bots from all over the place. You know, there's probably at least 50, maybe even 100 there. Just goes and goes and goes. And what you have to do is just watch a quick little thing. Sometimes the code's there. So we're just going to watch this. I'll show you how quick it goes. Who likes online video? <laughs> to get the word out that Progressive's name, your price tool can help you get a policy that fits your budget. I made this little video. Oh. So you just have to type that in. Yeah, like the you you mute her. Without something else will come up and you notice it actually changes. And it'll give you something to spell, which is kind of annoying, but we'll go back to the text. So you do have to listen to it again. Most likely it'll pop up being the same thing. Hi, person who likes online video. <laughs> to get the word out that Progressive's name, your price tool can help But just verify. Sometimes it does come up different. And then click the ping button and she'll stop talking. You know, just like the ones you're used to watching. Notice it's scrolling up here. Any distractions? Apparently, sometimes I want you to hear the whole thing. Again, it's advertising. So they just want to make sure that you're a real person sending this link out to the world and not just an automated software. Uh, again, so it's more just protection on their end. So hopefully we'll get this going and it'll pop through and this thing will be blank and it'll tell you where you stand in the queue. And there we go. So it just took a couple seconds. I have a couple other windows open. My computer's running a little slow day. Oh, it says it failed. Could be because I went back and forth. So let's try this again. Sometimes it's because of the website I put in there. Just make sure everything's good. So we'll try this one more time. Hi, person who likes online video. <laughs> to get the word out that Progressive's name, your price tool can help you get a policy that fits your budget. I made this little video. Oh. <laughs> you know, just like the ones you're used to watching. Now notice this time it changed. So just be careful of that. Distractions. Sometimes there's an issue if you try to do the same thing a couple times. Uh, well, I've already done it once. Like I said, you can't ping the same website or actually the web post twice within a few days. But notice it says starting the ping process here. So it should be good to go. Well, uh, notice I'm in position three. I'm going to pause this for a minute and show you what it's going to look like in a second. Otherwise, it could take uh, anywhere from five to ten minutes. Um, but you can kind of go and open up another video and start doing stuff. But I'll pause this video and we'll show you what it looks like in here in a second. 
All right, so we're back here, and if you remember a second ago, before I paused it, I was in position three. Now I'm in position one, and as I talk, it might actually go down to zero, and then we'll start to see some stuff scroll up. But I just want to let you know, you can actually go through, if you're, you're in position one, it's basically set. You could actually go through and uh, do another one. You'd click home, and I'll show you that after this is done, just so you show the process again. But you'd click home, and you'd go through, and you'd have a clear slate, and you'd start over again. The other thing, if you really are concerned and you want to verify your information, down below there's an email report area you can just fill in your email address here and email the report to you and it will actually send you if you want to be uh, forwarded their news newsletter you can just have that checked it's already automatically populated otherwise uncheck that like that and they won't send you the emails but they would send you a follow up the ping report just to show you where it's been uh, uh, delivered to so yeah we're just gonna give this another couple seconds it may take a couple minutes here I will pause it again and we'll pick it up in a all right, so here we are. We're back again, and you start to see where they've been posted. So we have all these blogs that, and search engines, and spiders that um, Pingler has pinged to. You notice it just scrolled automatically by themselves. You see, okay, sometimes it shows up that they're not okay or that it failed, and you know there's numerous reasons why that would go through. And then at the very, very end, once all is said and done, if I can get this to scroll down here, I can't seem to grab the scroll bar. It'll usually say ping process complete. So it'll keep going and it'll keep sending and then uh, you'll know you're basically done and good to go. And hopefully this has been uh, beneficial. Again, you're, you're really trying to reach out to more people online uh, to have the spider show up. So notice here are some ones that said they're failed. Again, it could just be maybe there was an issue with that spider or that bot. Yeah, I really don't know that answer. You'd have to uh, do a little searching for that. But again, just an extra resource. You write a blog post, you come over to Pingler and you ping it. Okay. There's also things... Uh, in your actual blog setup I can help you with if you really want to know uh, setting up certain blogs as well that you have an area to put blogs or uh, excuse me uh, things to actually ping and, and kind of bots to hook up there as well so uh, that's actually inside your WordPress inside the actual setting so um, if you're interested in that hit me up with an email Dave Gardner at magnetic sponsors.com and I will send you a copy of my uh, hidden list alright thanks bye